Did you know you can perform a two-point adjustment on the Pause Detector 6000 under the Calibration menu option to make it even more reliable? If not, we'll be showing you step-by-step -step how to do it, coming up. Hey everyone, Bill Corbett here with KTA, helping you to choose the correct coating inspection instruments, equipment, and gear, and showing you how to use it properly on your next project. Today I'm going to show you how to perform a two-point adjustment on your Pause Detector 6000 Type 2 electronic coating thickness gauge. A two-point adjustment is the preferred method to make sure your coating thickness gauge is working correctly before you take coating thickness readings. Remember that making adjustments in the shopper field is not the same as having the gauge calibrated by an accredited laboratory. That should be done annually and you should receive a certificate of calibration from the calibration laboratory. A two-point adjustment process includes taking several readings on the uncoated part and adjusting the zero set if needed, then on two known thicknesses, one on either side of the intended range of use. For example, if the specified thickness is 6 to 8 mils, we can verify accuracy and adjust at 5 mils and 10 mils. Let's step through this process. First, zero the gauge by taking 10 readings on the prepared, uncoated surface or on the zero plate on the certified coated standard set. Next, select the two-point adjustment menu option. Press plus to set the number of readings used to obtain an average. Usually three are sufficient. The display uses an arrow to indicate whether to set the probe on the surface or pick it up. Always follow the direction of the arrow. Repeatedly measure the thickness on the measured shim or a certified coated standard. Once a reading is displayed, lift the probe from the surface and adjust the reading up or down using the plus and minus buttons until the display shows the correct thickness value. Press the center of the middle button to accept this value. Repeat the same process for the second point using a thicker measured shim or certified coated standard. The gauge is now considered accurate in the range at which it was adjusted. A two-point adjustment using the Pause Detector 6000 is just that simple to do. We hope that you found this video useful. If you got value from this video, please give us a like, hit the subscribe button below, ring the bell, and follow us online to be updated about future videos like the one today. If you are in the market for other coating inspection gauges or calibration services, all the details are in the description below. See you next time.